Hey. My brother is a beatboxer. So Mara, what is epigenetics? Let's use beatboxing to understand it. Epigenetics is how genes are expressed differently based on outside factors without changing the genetic code. These effects can be positive or negative. In beatboxing, you note the patterns. If you're feeling creative, then you can adjust how you perform it. The written pattern doesn't change, but the way you express it can sound different. This might cause the sequence to sound a bit off, but it can also make it sound better. You know how to produce sounds with your mouth, and you can even do a few of them at the same time. <laughs> Each sound you create portrays a gene in the code being turned on. Layering the sounds depicts various genes functioning at the same time. I notice in a lot of beatboxing songs there are pauses. <laughs> this is the same as a gene turning off. It isn't deleted, just temporarily silent. One type of this is DNA methylation, which silences a gene by adding chemical tags that block genes from being transcribed into RNA. Histone modification can also turn genes off. DNA is wrapped around proteins called histones, and if they are too tight, then the transcription factor can't reach the DNA. These are a few of the many ways a gene can be suppressed. Your beatboxing sequences are complex with a combination of slow and fast beats. Genes can be expressed in different levels, times, and durations. It takes different lengths of time in order to see the effect of it. A completed beatboxing pattern is what the audience hears as a finished song, not just one beat. It represents a full genetic expression which was influenced by the environment to produce the phenotype. For a phenotype to show up, it usually requires many genes to be interacting. Overall, epigenetics shows that the way our genes show up can change depending on environmental and behavioral factors. There are many real-life examples that include epigenetics. For example, exercising turns on genes for muscle growth. Some cancers are also linked to incorrect genes either turning off or on. Do you understand it now? I still think I'm too young for that, but it sounds really interesting. I definitely understand it more than before. I'm really glad to hear that. Continue to be enthusiastic about learning. Epigenetics are epic. <laughs>